best wishes to all participants of the conference. To your attention, the results of the research work, technology of forming a wire-resistant intermittent wire layer based on the ferrum chromium carbon system by self-propagating high temperature synthesis. It is known that it is optimal to pure molten metal in the mode with a temperature close to the crystallization temperature. But even so, it is not possible to obtain two layer metallic castings due to the lack of the quality zone for the formation of functional layers. That is why the use of self propagating high temperature synthesis to form a wear resistant layer of thermal oil on a metal basis can be a cost-effective alternative uh, for the production of the metallic products. As I said, of determining uh, the optimal technological parameters of the form and wear resistant layer of thermal alloy based on the ferrum chromium carbon system has not been given sufficient attention. This area of research is quite relevant. When considering the technology, next materials were used of the components of the charge. To study the process of thermite voice of facing on a metal base was carried out in a mold consisting of the sand clay shell with the lid. To study the kinetics of the thermal process occurring in the mold during the formation of a layer, an experimental laboratory setup was additionally developed. In reality. To accelerate the heating time of the mold with correct a contact to open surface with the heated atmosphere of the surface, a mold with an open metal base in the lower part was made. In the base, lower part, open space. The use of this design uh, has reduced the heating time of the mold from 220 up to 90 minutes. However, it should be noted that it makes significant changes in the course of self-propagating high temperature synthesis. After initiating the combustion of the thermite charge for 0.5 minutes, from the beginning of the process, there is a sharp decrease in the temperature of the lower surface of the metal base. Analysis of thermocouples installed on the upper surface of the metal base, curve 2, showed that the total combustion time of the thermic chain is uh, 8.05 seconds, where the combustion from reaches the surface of the metal base and the temperature for one second rapidly increases to uh, 2054 kelvins, which indicates the beginning of the thermite void formation. All beginning termites uh, take place at the temperature of uh, 3,000 and 100, 3,200 kelvins, which exceeds the boiling point of iron. This, in turn, allows you to add to the charge of the metal fever in such volume that the temperature of the melt of form the functional layer was not uh, than 2,050. Oh, 574 kelvins. Uh, it's a four uh, curve. It's a temperature. 
the increases in the temperature of the thermite void directly depends on both the pre preheating of the mold and the amount of the uh, metal fever in the in the thermite charge. Thus, the result of the uh, process technology are obtained in samples of thermite alloy on the surface of which when the mold is uh, heated to 873 Kelvin. In the slug phase, metal inclusions are formed a spherical uh, shape. Sorry spherical shape slag. This is due to the rapid stage of combustion and the accompanied by intense spraying in the resulting synthesis metal. The result of study of adding to thermite charge of 40% of the metal fever are present in and fissure too. not heating, without heating, 473 kelvins, 673 kelvins, 873 kelvins, the best examples. When the thermite charge contains more than 40% uh, of metal fuel, Regardless of the heating temperature of the mold, there is a decrease in melt temperature which leads to the significant porosity as well as the presence of oxidized areas in the joint of the uh, heated melt. Like this. And this. In metallographic studies uh, on the formation zone of the thermite oil layer with a metal base at a heated temperature of the mold below uh, 473 kelvins, there was a loose connection of layers with the base. There were inclusions in slag. In the upper part, there were shrinkage shells. For samples obtained by heating the mold of 873 kelvins, the liquid state of the thermite oil was longer. Uh, the time to crystallization was uh, 16, uh, 60, 16 seconds. Uh, the surface of the metal base uh, melted. And the slag, consisting of corundium, emerged from the zone of functional layer formation. Thus, the zone of formation of the functional layer is characterized by stability of the macrostructure and the positive effect of corundum, which uh, creating the effect of inoculating modification for the thermite void, in turn uh, contributes to the formation of uh, chromium carbides. Uh, the obtained samples were uh, investigate to the such properties as uh, density of gravity, porosity and yield of alloy. It is shown that increasing of the amount of metal fever in the charge from uh, 80 to 40 percent when heating the mold to 873 Kelvin increases the yield of uh, suitable thermite alloy to 74% by weight of the original charge, of course. 
it increases the density of 7.05 kg per meter cube and reduces the porosity of the formed termite alloy to 5.5%. So, the technology of uh, forming of termite alloy layer on the basis of uh, ferrum chrome uh, carbon system on the metal by uh, self propagated high temperature synthesis process is, of, is offered, which allows to obtain cast from the functional layer with improved physical, mechanical, and operational par properties. It is shown that the increase in the amount of the metal filler from uh, 20 to 40 percent in the mold heated up to 873 Kelvin affects the properties of the form layer of termite alloy, increases the density of the alloy by uh, 33 percent, and decreases its porosity by uh, 17 percent while the yields of suitable termite alloy increases to 74 absolute percent. It should the, be noted that uh, lowering the heating temperature of the hold below of the mold, sorry, of the mold uh, below 873 Kelvin degrades the quality of the form termite alloy layer doesn't separate from the slug and released into a separate spherical formation. Metallurgical, uh, metallographic uh, studies of the optimal and obtaining war resistant layer of termite alloy showed that the zone of functional layer formation is characterized by uh, macrostructure stability, uh, positive effect of carundum, it is uh, obtained with alloy. In this case, non-metal inclusions in the form of corundum creating the effect of inoculating modification for the termite alloy in turn uh, contribute to the formation of coronium carbides. Uh, thank you for attention.